Hello everybody, welcome back to Padfoot City Games. My name is Zach, I'm the voice behind the icon, and today we're back in Microsoft Flight Simulator once again. And we're going to be leaving from Missoula, Missoula, Blech. Montana, and we're going to be heading out to Seattle, Washington today. It's about an hour flight or so, we'll see once we get up into uh, the air. We're going to do a quick walk around, hope you guys are having a good day, I know that I am. The flight coming in here was actually a pretty good one, besides uh, having to do a couple weird things to properly align ourselves for landing. But other than that, it was a pretty good trip earlier today. It's currently about uh, 5.55 p.m. in Missoula. We'll be heading out shortly. Our takeoff time is 6 p.m. Making sure I'm getting all those time differences right versus what I'm reading on my, uh, my own screen here. Wings are looking good. Come on up. Winglets are fine. Lights seem to be Intact. Ooh, I'm in the engine. Don't go in the engine. Engine's looking good. No cracks, no tears. Tires are looking good. And I have not taken a look at the front gear yet. But yeah, everything's looking pretty good. Do we have stairs or we're going to have to go in through the door? Uh, okay, we'd have to go in through the door. Let's head up to the flight deck and let's finish up our preparations to go. All right, now that we're back up on the flight deck, uh, the APU is going and we are all set there. We can disconnect exterior power. Let's chit chat with them and let's get our uh, taxi requests all set for us. I do believe we should be heading out of runway 30. And we're going to be climbing very quickly as we get ready to move and leave here. Sounds good. We'll give a quick read back and we will start getting ourselves all set here. Charlie Landing all set. Alpha, Performance already all set. Up top, FD is already on. Autopilot is ready to go. Door is locked. We are all set for pushback. So let's do some ground services. We will disconnect the jetway and we'll get ourselves pushed back and ready Delta to go. Right, seems all set there. We're going to disconnect the parking brake as well <clears throat> as he gets us ready to go. Everything else is seeming normal. Beacon lights on. We are being pushed back. Engine 2. Here we go. Okay, as everything continues to come up to speed, uh, that should engage here shortly. We'll get our flaps down one. Taxi light will come on since we are out. Anything else seems like it's ready to go. This one is available. Just clicked over. Good. Go up, turn off the APU bleed and APU itself. Let them know, hey, we are starting to taxi to the runway. Let's get on out of here. All right, you heard it from upstairs, everybody. Clear we are clear off, for takeoff. We get ourselves lined up and ready to go. One thing that I have noticed um, that we'll try to figure out once we're up in the air, I'm not super worried about it right now, but our uh, display right here, ours on the pilot side, is not responding. Um, so I'm not exactly sure why on that. Co-pilots is. We'll check out everything else as we... As we need to, but for right now, let's get lined up and let's get ourselves out of here. We are ready to go. Lined up. Bring up the engines. I'm going to bring them up to about a little bit faster than I wanted to, about 50%. Toga. Speed is climbing, short runway. Really pushing it. Up. Positive rate. Gears up. I'm gonna put on autopilot because it's very tricky to get in and out of here. Decimal nine or 
Delta 316. Flaps there. We're up in the air. Small Gear is up. Everything is good. We're actually turning out to the left so the right. Feet. That's okay. Really no idea why that one's not working right. Delta 316 is type Airbus A20 and 1 miles northwest of Missoula, 3,500 feet. Request flight following. Delta 316, smoke and approach. Squawk 0616. continuous plan. Looking good, climbing up to where we should be. Really like to know what's going on with that display. Very bizarre. See, that just seems to be dead. Never happened before. All right, well, we are up in the air and we are climbing, everybody. Enjoy your flight. As we get ourselves over the mountain, we definitely got a little bit of rocking in store for us today. We're above 10,000 feet now. Had a shoot out of there pretty quickly. Just to start getting over the mountain, mountains, but look at these snow-capped mountains. Beautiful. Is that a glacier? My friend out uh, in Montana did tell me that there is a glacier nearby. Not, not like in their backyard. Interesting. Yeah, so I have no idea why display one is dead. Um, really, I'd be passing over to the co-pilot for, sh for sure. We'll send over that next call. It's going to be a bumpy ride. Let them know they can use electronic devices now. Salt Lake Center Delta Tree 16 is passing 13,700. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome aboard your Delta flight today. I hope you're going to enjoy your ride out to Seattle. You can tell right now as we're getting a little bit of wind shear off the top of those mountains. Uh, we're going to keep the seatbelt sign on so we can continue our climb and hopefully we can get out of some of this uh, shortly for a smoother ride for you. If there's anything that we can do to make your flight more comfortable, just let one of our stewardess know. Thank you for flying Delta, and we'll see you guys soon. All right, let's get ourselves up to 240. Just try to get out of some of this mount wind shear from the mountains. Because we be a rockin'. We've reached our cruising altitude of 36,000 feet. Looks like the radar has finally... <laughs> uh, not, a, not the radar. You know, you know what I mean. Turn those into words. Looks like it's finally fixed itself. we still got a little while to go, but I'm more than happy to turn off that seatbelt sign. 
Just call up front, let them know. It looks like we're going to have some smooth sailing for now. A little choppy here and there. You can see it right now. Uh, but overall, we should be fine according to my map. So, Seattle, here we come. Right, descent has begun. We're going down to three zero zero. Alpha three one six descent and maintain sixteen thousand feet. Just saying. Holy crap beautiful if anybody's been watching this channel at all and if anybody remembers when we were doing some x-plane i flew past this mountain on one of the only episodes that we had ever filmed and it hit me now i can't even tell from the backside of this mount st helen or not but we went past mount st helen and my jaw dropped i think this might be it just because it's missing half of the freaking mountain um and it blew my mind and still Awestruck, here I stand as we come down to about 11.5 thousand feet. We're going to descend into these clouds, and Seattle, here we come. All right, we're getting ready to make our final turn in Seattle here. Ooh, I wanted to look to the left. Thank you. Again, slightly choppy. I know I'm doing other stuff on the Internet, but come on. All right, we'll reduce you back down to 10. I'm going to drop flaps one. Let's get the rest set up, shall we? Medium. Clicked and engaged, ready to go. I also bet you it has something to do with recording audio, video, and uh, attempting to play the game at the same exact time. Oh, and recording the video to have the replay data. <laughs> I am sure it's fine. So the uh, ILS <clears throat> should pick it up right here at Douglas. So we're going to keep an eye on that. Frames are settling in a little bit more now that Seattle's out of view. Let's just take a peek at that really quick. <laughs> Love the amount of detail, but Jesus kills the frames. Been to Seattle once, left on a ship. Right from there. Amazing. All right, back focus forward. Don't don't be lagging like that. Come on, I believe in you. Why are we looking up? I just want to make sure. Are you set? Because you're not really responding to me. Come on. Okay, you are armed. Thank you for being so helpful. <laughs> okay, we're at flaps two. Runway's in sight. Here's hoping for a smooth landing here in Seattle. What do you think? Delta 316, you are one one miles north of Seattle. Contact Seattle Tower on one two zero decimal nine or five when inbound on the approach. I mean, I feel like I'm already Tower pretty close. I really want to turn on approach. Like, really, really badly while I'm trying to approach. Delta Tree 1610 miles north inbound ILS runway 16 left approach. Delta Tree 16 Seattle Tower. Altimeter Tree 0 decimal 02 wind 208. I'm going to do it. It'll capture it in this. Runway 16 left approach. Fantastic. All lights are on. We are all set. Flap. Uh, I'm dropping here a little bit, actually. Dropping to flaps three. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey, that's best. What was that? You just got a chirp in the cockpit. Great. That's always good.
Another airport right in front of us. We're going to go over. Again, we're right on glide slope. We are right where we want to be for a good landing here in Seattle. Flaps to full. Gear down. Checking with the cabin. Calling forward. Come on, frames. I want to still love you. Let me love you. <laughs> Clear to land, that's why we love to hear. I was going to say, I thought I did see another one on our radar. Clear to land, runway, one six left, Delta they must be heading six. over on 3-6 uh, right. 1-6 uh, right, I should say. Yeah, I know I'm flying over another airport. Thank you for freaking out at me. I do love that beacon just screaming in my ear. Very much appreciated. current weather here anyways. It's uh, 69 degrees. I'm actually really surprised. 69 degrees. Beautifully sunny. Beautiful day. Thing is, I could take over. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let it do its thing. As we always do. 1,000. <laughs> Throttle in hand. Hand on the stick. Landing has been initiated. We are good. Flying over these poor, poor sobs in the worst possible location. <laughs> Planes flying over your house all day and all night. <laughs> 500. I'm going to take it away at, I don't know, three. 400. 400. Yeah, see, I'm not going to take it yet. See how we're fighting the wind? 400. Let the plane fight the wind for you. 300. 300. My plane, my aircraft. Two hundred. Two hundred. 200. 100. Again, we're, we're a little left of center. 50. Just like 40, last time. 30. 20. Retard. 10. 5. We're down. Ooh, rough. I don't know why ILS is pushing us so far to the left. Right, we're here in Seattle. Gonna finish uh, slowing down. We'll actually be able to take this right here. Fantastic. Get the uh, APU started. I'd like to. Thank you. Going to one two six decimal two five. Landing light off. Strobe light off. Contact ground. Taxi to the gate, please. Ground Delta 316 request taxi to the gate. Delta 316 taxi to gate. Charlie 17 via taxiway route now. Taxiing to gate Charlie 17 using taxiway Bravo Delta 316. 
Right, flaps are up. APU is running. Made in 76 minutes. Not bad. 77, actually. I'm happy with that. Let's turn on the APU bleed. That just came available. Slow our roll here a little bit. have to start taking over the plane a little bit sooner to get ourselves lined up on the runway, I'm thinking. Come on. A little bit more speed. A little less speed. Yeah, the jetway shouldn't be here. Keep on going, keep on going. I'm listening to my little dude on the ground. Brakes. All right. E-brake set. Engine down. Lights are off. Beacon's off. I'd like to continue, please. Beacons are off. Engines are coming down. Fast seatbelt sign can be off. Ground services. Let's get that jetway out from Ground inside the airplane. Could you please connect the jetway to the aircraft? Yeah. So it's not completely attached would be pretty awesome. Yeah, see, this is the problem here. <laughs> the scale of your airports are not uh, super accurate. And there you go. All right. Well, there you go. There you have it. Let's see how we did on the landing. All right, well, there you have it, everybody. We have successfully made it to Seattle. Uh, I really hope that this new update that they have coming in a couple of weeks is going to work on some of the performance for Flight Sim. Um, and also, again, this is a work in progress community mod, um, <clears throat> but I'm, I'm getting confused <laughs> on why we're so left of center. So we'll start just taking control of the plane a little bit earlier and getting ourselves pushed back over. Not the end of the world. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. That's going to do it for this one. If you did enjoy, we do try to get a video out here on the channel every single day. 
and uh, we really do thank you guys for your support for getting us past 600 subscribers so quickly. But with that, I thank you guys so much for coming out to this one, and we will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.